Hello viewers, this is IT System Admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix cannot extend C drive because of recovery partition in Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. Sometimes it becomes very important for you, so don't forget to watch full video. First of all, right click on start menu, click on disk management, look, this is C drive, I want to extend this C drive and I will bring the storage area from D drive, but the problem is this is a healthy recovery partition is in between C and D drive. Okay, now first of all, I will shrink some areas from D drive. Right click on D and click on shrink volume. I am just more than 200 dB area. I will shrink from D drive click on shrink look this is 237 GB okay now right click on it click on new simple volume next and next and the drive letter is F no problem next and the file system is NTFS. Click on next and then finish. Okay, now F drive has been created and uh, formatted. Now I will copy all data from D drive to F drive. Open it and now select all then click on right click and click on cast and then click on F drive. Now paste all document here. Now, all data are copying from D drive to F drive. It will take some time. All files have been copied from D drive to F drive. Okay, now close File Explorer. Now right click on D drive. Click on Delete Volume. This is an warning message. Click on Yes. Now Again, the warning message, click on yes. Okay, now 153 GB is unallocated right now, but still I can't extend C drive because in between this unallocated storage and C drive, there is a 744 MB healthy recovery partition. This is the barrier, so I can't extend C drive using this 153 GB unallocated areas. Okay, right click on C drive, look, still extend volume is disabled. 
Okay, now close disk management. Click on search, type CMD. Right click on command prompts and click on run as administrator. Click on disk part. Okay. Disk part is a single word. Now hit enter. Okay. Common prompt has been entered into disk part utility. Now type list disk disk number is zero because I have only one hard disk here. Okay, now click now type select disk zero now disk. Zero has been selected. Now type list partition. Look here, I have seven partitions here, and my recovery partition is partition five. Okay, I am checking again. Right click on start menu, click on disk management. Look, this is the healthy recovery partition. Click here. Look, this is the disk partition 0. Again, click C drive, C is selected, click here, and now partition 5 is selected. That means partition 5 is our target partition. Okay, now type select partition 5. Hit enter. Now partition 5 is selected. Now type the command delete A space partition override. Delete partition overwrite okay now hit enter this part successfully deleted the selected partition okay now exit from this part now hit enter and now close command prompt again right click on start menu Click on disk management. Now look, the recovery partition is also unallocated and added with my previously unallocated storage areas. Okay, now right click on C drive. Look, now extend volume is enabled. Click on extend volume. And then next, and disk 0, 0158008 MB. That means uh, 154 GB areas already selected from here. Okay, and uh, the total volume size in megabyte is here. And the maximum available space also showing here. 
and selected amount of space in megabyte 158004 okay click next and then now click finish before click finish look now my c drive area is 246 gb and now click finish look now my c drive is 400 gb i have successfully extended my c drive close disk management open file explorer click on this pc look now c drive is 400 gb and i have successfully extended my c drive close file explorer this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much